Looking at the rest of the uh, standings, um, obviously we don't know who the sevens and the eights are going to be, which I guess is why they don't want me to call it the playoffs. But we've got, we've got the Thunder in the one seed. First of all, that's an incredible accomplishment for the Thunder in the one seed. For sure. Yeah. They're food, but congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the Nuggets as a two seed. Again, we don't know who the one and the two seeds are playing. The Nuggets, I think we all kind of feel they're coming out of the West. I, I don't. I have not heard anyone express a different yeah. sentiment than that. Yeah. John? You said what? The, the Nuggets? Nuggets coming out of the West. We all feel that yes! way. Yes. Yeah. You thought I was going to say something different? No. I just, you know. You question my intelligence. In I'm just double America. checking, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't that uh, a double check, nigga? That's fucking nuggets. <laughs> we just talked about like old a... boy as a Terminator. You feel me? <laughs> Bro, hell yeah. Is that a nuggets non-believer, brother? <laughs> <laughs> uh, the three versus the <laughs> three. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I'm sorry. I really came in a group chat like that. <laughs> <laughs> Is that... <laughs> John sent the funniest text he's ever sent I've, I've ever received last week, and I can't tell you what it's about, unfortunately. Oh, but um, I'm sure it'll come out down the line <laughs> at some point, years gotta from put now. Some time. I've got to put some time in between it for the show. Um, the three versus the six is the Timberwolves versus the Suns. Was there a matchup that Timberwolves fans were going to feel good about? Probably the Pelicans. Probably the Pelicans. If they had, if they had gotten the Pelicans, if they the probably Pelicans would have been happy. But, but yeah, if the Pelicans weren't going to win. <laughs> I think they, what, what, what did the final score of the Lakers Pelicans game end up being? They were up by thirty points when we left the house. I think it was like twenty. Game. I think it was about twenty. <laughs> that shit was crazy. All right, uh, I know that I, I know from Twitter that Timberwolves fans don't feel great about playing the Suns. How do you guys uh, feel about that series? I mean. Like, I think we're going to learn so much about both teams in that series, right? Like, you know, I still do not believe that the Suns are going to advance far in the postseason. I don't know what to think of of the Wolves. Like, I, the Wolves, I wouldn't be surprised if they get bounced in the first round or if they advance to the Western Conference Finals, right? But, um, but yeah, I, I think we're going to find out a whole lot about both of these teams in this postseason because, like I said, um, I've had, a, especially with the Suns, I had a lot of questions. I was like, bro, they just do not play the type of basketball that wins you games in the playoffs, right? Just, just, just yeah. to rely on on the star power that they've got there. But um, and I'm all, and I've also been like, you know, this this Wolves squad looks legit. I don't really have a knock on them as as far as the the the, uh, the regular season that they've had. But I'm just like, it's just something that 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 I'm not sold on with them, right? Like maybe they're not battle tested yet. That might be it. But like I said, I think we're just, we're just gonna learn a whole lot about both these teams in in this series, and I'm looking forward to it. I think we're gonna see some from Ant Edwards, bro. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I could see him really stepping the fuck up. I think it starts with him talking about McDaniels. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying like, yo, they got K they got KD, but we got McDaniels. You feel what I'm saying? So like, mm -hmm. I think we're gonna see something really special from him. I think I think the the Wolves pull it off. But I mean, yeah, it's it's an ugly matchup. As a fan, I'd be nervous as hell. But that that, that Suns team really isn't that good. They have they're heavy up top. They have great scores. They have a god in KD, obviously. You know what I mean? But I just think you know the Timberwolves are a complete squad on both ends. <clears throat> Here. I do think the Suns are good. They're and young, I, though. They're young. They're young. But and there's that. I, I think what we have to keep in mind is like this is just a historically good West. The the Suns and the Pelicans as the six and the seven seeds won forty nine games. The team who won forty nine games in the East is the Bucks as the three seed. That's the seven seed in let's, the West. Let's stop talking about the East, bro. <laughs> the, <laughs> the, I looked that up today. The, the Lakers, the yeah. Lakers, Kings, and Warriors, who are eight, nine, and ten, would have been the four seed last season in the West. Right. Last, I mean, the, 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 the Warriors are the ten, are the ten, and are ten games over five hundred. First like, time it's ever happened in either conference. So I, I, so I think like yes, I hear you on the Suns, but I think it's you know that's a team with an all time great that's forty nine and thirty three. Mm -hmm. versus it, it, you're right like why don't we trust the timberwolves is it the name of the team is it <laughs> i think like, it's the I name of the you, team and the name of the center <laughs> <laughs> those he's are very real factors year. those are very yeah real yeah factors. he's better this year i don't know uh, katie hasn't had that can can booker do what he did last year that's going to be very difficult the nigga looked like um, impossible right like he looked, it's, it's, I think it's impossible. He was looking like the best that. player on that team last post. On that team, and one of the best guards. It, like, mm. like it, it, we, it's one of the best performances like I've seen in a long time in the playoffs. He just every time he let the ball go, it looked like it was cash fucking money, and for the most part, it was. Yeah. I think it's gonna be hard to repeat that. 
And KD hasn't seemed like the god in moments that we've, that, you know, in the playoffs the last couple of seasons that we've seen in years prior. So, you know, this year's had a great year. I mean, hello, you know, Bobby, I, I don't know. We'll see. And it could have been because he was new to the Suns. He barely played it. What, he played like three games prior to the playoffs starting? I mean, dude, we, we expected a lot of the man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So maybe that was it, was, is it. But we'll see. We'll find out. Um, the series I think we're all most excited about, the four and the five in the West. Two 50-win teams. Incredible players on both sides. Great teams on both sides. Genuine dislike, I think, for each other uh, between some of the players. Clippers, Mavericks. This, to me, is the best series in the first round. Do you agree? Yes. Hell yeah. Yeah, I mean, I I love this rivalry that's been already built up between like Luke and, and the Clips, and we've seen him bounce them before. And um, this Clippers squad is perhaps the best Clippers squad that we might have seen in our lifetimes. But it feels like Luca and Kyrie have kind of figured out that two man mm-hmm. game just a little. So you know, he's finally got some reinforcements too, even though you know the Clippers have reloaded. So yeah, that's going to be a really, really, really fun series. And then watching Kyrie lately, like he's, he's the backup to Luka and Kyrie, it seemed like he's taking it to a different level we haven't seen in a long time. You feel me? So I, 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 like, I like the Mavs. I like the Mavs. Mm. I still think the Clips pull it off, but, but, I, but I think the Mavs will put up a hell of a fight. I think the Clips win too, but I will enjoy rooting for Luka <laughs> against the Clippers. I will have a lot of fun doing that, and, and it would be yeah. hilarious if they beat the Clippers to me because it, it, this is like maybe the best Clippers team we've ever seen, and it would be hilarious if they end up as the four seed getting bounced in the first round. The 82-game preseason is in the books, and it's finally time for the real season. Don't miss out on any of the NBA playoff action at DraftKings Sportsbook an official sports betting partner of the NBA. From the playing tournament through the finals, DraftKings Sportsbook has you covered with same game parlays, live betting, odds boosts, and so much more. I still feel like the Nuggets are the team to beat this year, but some of these young squads might make some noise. Download the DraftKings Sportsbook app and use code Jenkins. New customers bet $5 and get $200 in bonus bets instantly. That's code Jenkins only on DraftKings. The crown is yours. 